Now this is actually the part of the mining that I don't really enjoy that much, is extending the main shaft, because, I don't know, it's just a big area to, uh, to dig out. That's okay. It's gotta be done at, uh, at some point. We're getting some more experience, uh, we're gonna hit 30 experience right here in this vein of coal, I bet. Which means we can enchant some stuff, so maybe we'll have to get the enchanting uh, room up and running um, in one of next week's episodes. I have a lot of plans for, for next week or the following week. Um, I'm going to be out of town um, next week, so I guess I can make that announcement here. Um, yeah, I'll be uh, I'll be visiting my wife for a um, couple of days. So, but there will be videos, of course, as always, three days a week. Plus, um, depending on how long I play here, um, I'll have some footage to upload from this. So anyone who isn't here, who missed it, you can see that over on the channel. Okay, get more redstone. Which is always good. We'll have to hook up some redstone gadgets, I think, at some point in the future. I'm not that good with redstone, but, um, you know, I do okay. Now, I don't have any logs with me, because I put them all in the chest. Um, so let's see, we'll just count this out. One, two, three. So we'll need one here. So, put a torch there. And then... One, two, three, and then so we need one more layer here. I don't know why I'm using dirt. I could just use the stone. <laughs> I could just leave the stone there. What's the video schedule nowadays? Um, well, every Monday, uh, Wednesday, and Friday is Minecraft in the morning. And then I have the caverns on Tuesday and Thursday. So, Minecraft in the morning airs around 8 a.m. Eastern. Um, if the scheduling uh, <laughs> is correct, I know. Uh, I think it was last week I had a bit of a kerfuffle with um, the scheduling. It, uh, it decided to release all the videos as soon as I uploaded them um, and set them all to public. So, some people saw um, the videos ahead of time. <laughs> I guess they got a little sneak peek by accident. Um, but uh, normally it's 8 a.m., and then the caverns is about 4 p.m. Uh, Eastern uh, on Tuesday and Thursday. So, and you're not going to want to miss uh, the episode for today, which airs at 4. Um, I don't want to give a spoiler, but uh, I find something very valuable down in the caverns, and I'm very excited. Um, so there's that. And then I also have the Ursa Miner, um, more Minecraft, uh, and uh, I'm working on a, an episode. Uh, I'll be recording that today. I'm not sure when that will go up, either today or tomorrow. Um, probably tomorrow. Yep, it's, um, well, it's sort of morning. It's uh, before noon, so it's uh, about 11 a.m. Uh, for me right now on the... Uh, eastern side of the United States. Um, so, um, there's no real schedule for Ursa Minor. That pretty much just goes up um, whenever I have a video for it, and it's been rather infrequent. But, um, I'm working on it. I'm working on getting, um, getting it to be more uh, reliable as far as uh, when I upload videos for that. It's just that I've had a lot going on recently. So, and then there's also, um, I'm going to be starting a new series. It's, um, the Ursa Minor Feed the Beast, which takes place on our Feed the Beast server. Um, and that I'm actually playing with my mother, who, uh, has a nice new computer that I built for her, and, uh, she plays Tech It and Feed the Beast and regular Minecraft, and she's quite addicted to it like I am, so she'll be joining me there. So she's kind of learning the ways of the, uh, the feed the beast so and i'm learning a lot of a lot of things too there's a lot of mods in that that aren't in the regular tech it so
Hello, Mark. Markio Bros. I guess. I'm not really sure how to say a lot of your names. Um, a lot of you I'm saying for the first time. Yeah, be sure to catch up. Uh, the, um, at least as far as the landscape is, the, uh, the series is quite linear, so if you haven't watched the um, later episodes, you'll want to catch up. Yeah, definitely. So, okay, so this is one here. That's going to be an arch. And then that's going to be an arch, so we're going to have a shaft here. And we can fill that in for now. I'll fill it all in with smooth stone. I like to have the main shaft be nice and, um, I don't know, uniform, nice looking. Okay, so shaft or er, support there, support there, and support there. So shaft here. Yeah, I'm going to need a new pickaxe soon, um, but I have one. See? So, yep, we're all good. We're all good to go. All right, I don't. I think that's good. Um, let's go up and get um, get the logs. We can finish the arches, and then we'll uh, and we'll make some 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 armor like you wanted me to. And we'll go into that cave and see what we can find. Hello, Durman. Good morning. How how angry you sound today. <laughs> Yeah. Your coffee's better, huh? Crap beverage. Yeah. You don't know what my coffee tastes like. My coffee is delicious. Ah. Delicious, delicious coffee. Ah. I normally drink something, um, you know, a little more, um, I don't know, flavorful, but uh, today I'm just uh, drinking regular old medium roast Colombian it's what I've got, so. I don't know, it's nice to take a break from the flavors. Um, wow, we are going to need <laughs> more storage. Oh, right, we're putting cobblestone here, okay. That'll help. It's nice to take a break from the flavors every now and then, just to, uh, you know. That way when you get back to them, you appreciate them a little bit more, you know. Okay, eggs are going in there. And, uh, okay, we got the wood. Let's, uh, let's make that armor. Okay, let's make ourselves a hat, and uh, some pants. Whoop, that is not iron. <laughs> well, it, I mean, it's made out of iron, I guess. <laughs> Ambrosia coffee, that is a cauldron. Um, there we go, that's a chest plate. Ambrosia coffee, huh? I've had ambrosia apples. <laughs> or you're just trying to say that your coffee is that good, huh? It's uh, the coffee of the gods, Durman is suggesting in the chat. He's slurping very loudly. Okay, is it nighttime? I think it is. It's very dark out there. I can't really see the sky very well. I might have to put in some sort of skylight or something. But let's take another nap, I suppose. Coffee of the gods. Okay. Ah, there we go. What do you guys think about the tree? Uh, I've left it up. I mean, I guess I could, I don't know what I could do to try and mask it, but I like having it there. I mean, it makes sense. It's, I mean, it's still snowy over there after all. But uh, I understand if it's a little bit out of place. I didn't burn my tree down like they did on the server. Oop. Mr. Coffee? Durman, come on now. You should get a, a nice coffee maker. We have um, a bun in our house, and it's a, it's a 
very nice. Oh wait, no, we don't have the bun. We used to have a bun. Those are, um, I don't know. I mean, I guess people think that those are really good coffee makers, but honestly, I don't know. I'm not really a fan anymore. We have a, a Cuisinart, um, and uh, it's really good. I, I love that coffee pot. It's very, very nice. It has a, um, a vacuum sealed um, um, carafe, and uh, it's wonderful. It keeps the coffee hot for like 14 hours. You can make the coffee at um, 8 a.m. when you wake up, and then, you know, at uh, about 10 o'clock at night, it's it's still hot. Like it's still steaming. It's quite amazing. Um, and it has the carbon filter in it and everything. And I don't know. I really like it. So it's actually not even mine. It was um, a gift uh, from me uh, to my mother. So. But because of our schedule, she normally gets up before me, so she usually makes the coffee. So sometimes I don't have a choice in what I'm drinking, but um, it's fine because I don't have to get up and make the coffee. I can just get up and drink it. Um, yeah, the gift that keeps on giving, yeah. Definitely. Every morning. Well, unless uh, some days when I don't have to go to work, I actually don't drink coffee. I'll just have tea. Um, but I'll usually have a caffeinated tea, like a green tea or something. Oh, a coffee urn. Hmm. One of these days, um, as well, I'm going to have to get a, uh, a vacuum-sealed um, um, carafe for uh, hot water for tea um, to have on my desk so I can refill my cup, I think. Because right now, uh, I just have my electric kettle, and uh, it's wonderful. I love it. It heats up water in seconds. Um, but there's one bad thing about it in that um, it has no thermal insulation whatsoever. So, So, yeah. Hmm. I actually, um, I'm not familiar with, uh, Philips coffee machines. I've never really had one, nor seen one, so... I don't really have an opinion on that. But, um, Philips is one of those companies, though, that I do kind of trust, um, to a point. So, you know, they make pretty good products, so... I hear, <laughs> I hear a lot of monsters in here. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, hello. Where did you come from? Behind me. Oh, you know what? I really should have made a new sword as well. Okay. Mm -hmm. the zombie's gonna jump out at me and push me into the lava. <gasps> oh, you know what? I forgot my, my bucket, my water bucket. I might have to go get my bucket. Yep. I'm gonna have to get the bucket. If it's upstairs, I'll go ahead and make a new sword. If not, uh... Well, we only have one sword. Yeah, let's go make a new sword. I'm sorry, I'm so disorganized this morning. Oh... That's okay. Oop. Let's see. 